with 22 miss. Actually, three shots. So I guess I'm going to be in for a little target practice today somehow. And uh, there's my old saw, Betsy. <laughs> I put a new bar and chain on it, and uh, the bar is uh, John's rid in the saw's frontier. Anyway, uh, works. So I'm gonna finish. I cut them two little small ones here now. And this stuff here, you come in this evening just before dark, and the rabbits will be right around it. And where it's froze now, it's easy to come up with this thing. Anyway, gotta get at it. Thanks. Oh, Kitten. I'll let that go. What are you doing anyway? Huh? This is Link's, uh, Link's trail set I'm making here. One snare there. One right there. One right there. And one right there. That's four. And there's a bit of beet. And a bit of beaver pride. And I found that works pretty good. Anyway, so I'm going right up to the road right there. And this is the uh, the road comes down this way, and the road comes in this way. It goes on through. So it's kind of a branch road, and we got prevailing winds. From the north blows on the road, from the west blows on the road. Well, we get easterly wind. Uh, it'll be a while before it gets to scent anyway, so easterly wind is not all that good. But we don't get that all the time, this time of year here, so out. That, so I'm going to put a snare. Right here, this one, and I always take a bit of evergreen, rub my hands with the evergreen, and I uh, just take the snare like this, and I rub this the snare with some of this fur, bow, until it almost burns actually, and that leaves the scent on that snare of the fir tree. So. Really, really works. Uh, works well. So, or anyway, I think so do. Okay, so we'll we'll fix up that snare right there now, and uh, put some bows in there. Door bows, we call it. And that's the one. It's about a seven inch loop, seven, eight inches loop in it. And so I'm gonna finish cutting the trail. And there's the there's the road right there. Sun is shining there you but there's the road right there anyway, so yeah, out. Now I'm going to uh, do another uh, trail set here now, uh, by the road, just seen from the road about. 25 feet in a bit of uh, fir, a few fir, light fir trees. So uh, what I'm going to do, I just get a, a half decent dry stick and uh, something like this. This here is a bit of beaver pride musk or whatever you want to call it, beaver pride we call it here on the rock. And I just get, I got rabbit fur and stuff in with that mixed and some lateral stuff. So I'm just going to smear some of this around here. <sighs> they love beaver. Links. This is again. A trail set. Which I find. <sighs> this is old. A bit of old stuff. I'm going to do I'm just going to Stick it in here at the rain. Somewhere. They'll draw. 
it don't need as much as that, but anyway, I got lots of, lots of it, so. And also, when you're looking for a bit of link sign or anything like that, you swing when the season closes. It's only open for a month. I think it's the seventh or something. Uh, it's only open for a month, and uh, you can always swing by on Skidoo, see if there's any new ones around. They'll be hanging around this area, a few rabbits and stuff, as you can see. Anyway, that's, uh, that's the, the beaver pride. Got on the stick. There's the trail goes out through there, my trail. And they usually like to follow. Okay, it's the finished set right there. So, anyway, I'll continue on to the road right there. That's the road right out through right there. So I'm just going to go so far now with this trail and leave it so you'll smell it anyway. Out. This area right here. It's a rabbit lead and they follow those rabbit leads and that's the spot where he walks through out. Anyway, I had the snare struck up there once. Yeah, the rabbits is doing a lot of going around with no links. Whew. Boy, he's in by the pod, that's all. Better thing to lose him. This is my last uh, snare check for the uh, for this year for fur and uh, let you have a look at that now. Not a bad little lynx. Uh, well, he's actually he's a big lynx and he's nice. As a male, which is a good thing. A few spots there, but. I'll curl up there now and tell you. Anyway, it's a beautiful day or the day, so I'm boiling up, boiling the kettle there now. Have a lunch. I'm boiling up the kettle now. Have a cup of tea and a few sardines. This is the last day of uh, January and uh, I'm using a bit of snow for my kettle. And that's 
I don't know the what's water there, but that works. Oh, yeah. Here's the lynx paw, and that's what keeps them up on the snow. So you can pretty well see that's pretty big. Yeah, yeah, it's the back paw. I had to make up a winch for the, whoops, I had to make up a winch for to keep the bugger up. And this is his front paw. You can see, <laughs> it's pretty big. And there's his claws. Retractable. You just push on the bottom, and it comes. Anyway, he took my rabbit. I had a rabbit set up there in the trail. And he was doing the cutie on me. So, uh, looks like a old dog. I don't know for sure, but they got something there that looks like nuts. Anyway, get that one cleaned. And uh, on the board, beautiful links. Few spots on. Yeah. Oh man. Blood still on his paws from the rabbit. There's my winch. I had to make up because I got a bad arm. Hurt my arm now. Along with the crutches that I'm on. Crutch, I should say. I'm on one crutch now. Anyway, out. Yep, I see one. Another one. Followed the rabbit lead. And I had to snare right in the rabbit lead. So that's his mistake. Out. Wolf track there for sure. Yeah, the wolf. Yeah, yeah. Came out the road right there. Yeah. Another mink right there. Morning, what? Yeah, I'll get that one out now and show you. Looks like a big one too. Along the little waterfall there. A little river. A nice spot there for a fox near on that tree coming across the brook there. Oh. Yeah, nice. nice big one. And it looks like another one. Around there. Rabbit there. Something's been picking at it. I guess it's a hawk. Looks like there's a otter track right there. Coming up out of the ice and uh, one up on the side there, fooling around and coming down over on that side. He went on down the river. I don't have a trap there now. I took it off. Anyway, I guess I'll put one back. Again, and that's the mink. Yeah, 
Lynx tray. Right here. And looks like he killed a rabbit right here. So yeah. He dies down the line. Anyway, there's a bit of bait there. Yeah, another rabbit. Legs up. January 2nd.